Hi guys, so just a short video today just to explain why I'm going to be away from YouTube for a little while just like a couple of weeks but I've been making videos less frequently because I've been trying to concentrate on just making my content better and kind of keeping it quite specific to music and stuff so it doesn't seem all over the place and confusing. Also you probably know if you've been watching my videos for a while that I have been looking for a band for a very long time um, like literally about five years and I finally found a band and we're getting along really well and we've started writing towards an EP and stuff and obviously concentrating on just writing my own music and stuff like that and trying to like and just trying to push myself musically in like the real world as well like playing more open mic nights and stuff I'd love to be able to do some kind of tour one day but I just got literally no idea right now I just need to stop building things in that kind of way. Any kind of growth for me has been really slow I've been doing music since I was like eight years old and still never took myself to play a gig outside of Manchester. I've done open mic nights, like when I've been on holiday and stuff. The main reason for that is that I need a full-time job, obviously, to live. So I'm working four or five days a week, as well as trying to treat music as if that's my full-time job. Um, so yeah, it's just a bit difficult. Anyway, I'm not complaining, I'm just explaining what's going on. So for YouTube, because YouTube's the best way for me personally to get my music out there um, mainly because I don't really have anyone telling me what to do if that makes sense there's no kind of criteria for like what I have to play or sing or um, what time I have to do it or anything but to help myself and to change things up a little bit for myself I'm gonna try doing things in a bit more of a scheduled way and just getting a bit more help from my friends um, so what I was thinking of doing is uploading on Tuesdays, Wednesdays and Thursdays so it's three days in a row right in the middle of the week so that works well because I know me personally I just like to binge watch things and kind of pay attention to someone kind of a lot for a short while and then forget about them for a while sounds wrong but um, rather than kind of watching someone for five minutes a week I'd rather watch them for like 15 minutes over the course of two days and then like just move on for a week or something um I don't know if that's made any sense but I'm basically taking inspiration from partly the way bands do things where they like release an album music videos are coming out the albums come out there's new merch they go on a tour boom 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 everything's in your face that like this is your favorite band for a couple of months and then they go away for a while and you forget about them and you do other things and then they come back and you still care about them so you're gonna pay attention again but yeah it works in kind of like cycles and also with it with YouTube being a video thing, um, I was thinking about doing it in seasons, like five or six weeks, then a couple of weeks break, something like that. So, I hope I'm not rambling too much. So yeah, I'm going to be taking inspiration from Good Mythical Morning a little bit, and also from my friends at Samsara Sessions. You might not know who Samsara Sessions are, I've worked with them before and now I've like joined them as a core team member which is really cool so hopefully they'll be in my videos more often. If you follow me on Instagram and stuff you probably will have seen me post like our group picture and stuff. So I was thinking on Tuesdays I could upload like a vlog kind of video, either just a day trip or something really cool I've done that week or a full like week vlog, you know some days do like little clips from every day of the week or even just like story time or just anything like that that isn't musical it could be music related but not an actual music video and then on the Wednesdays I'll do the actual music video which is what I normally upload um, where it's either just me playing a cover song or me playing one of my originals and then on the Thursday it will be like this week's song kind of like not a behind the scenes but it, just going into like either a review of that song because obviously reviews are another cool thing on YouTube um, or like why I chose the song, what the lyrics mean to me or if I wrote the song, same kind of thing um, yeah I'm gonna work this stuff out a bit more in detail but yeah I was thinking about doing something like that, like that. or even maybe a tutorial for the song if there's 
any kind of request for that kind of thing because people often ask for tutorials but I just really don't feel like I'm good enough on guitar a lot of the time. I don't even know the chord names so that was, yeah. That's my plan for YouTube. I'm going to keep writing with my band because obviously when my band gets going I want it to be a proper band, not like Lizzie Tupman and the, or like a part time thing. I want this to be a band, like I want to release an EP, I want to do tours and uh, all the the full shebang you know what i'm saying one of the other big things is obviously joining samsara which i've already mentioned uh link in the description to their youtube also i have new t-shirts out another thing i've been trying to sort out a little bit has been like merch designs and stuff like that and how i can sell them properly and same with cds because obviously you can sell them at gigs and you can also sell them online or like just to your friends or something like that so obviously if i started figuring out these ways of earning money doing what I'm doing then I can limit my hours at whatever job I'm working and put more time into it and the more time I can put into it the more it becomes a possibility that I could do what I want to do full time. Yeah there's a link in the description to my t-shirts I'll be putting pictures up everywhere of my t-shirts and obviously it would just help me out a lot if you would buy them. <laughs> So yeah, I don't ask for anything like a Patreon, um, but obviously if you like the t-shirts designs, that's really cool. It's the illustration by Matt Roth, it's the EP cover for my EP teeth, and you could also buy the EP on Bandcamp for, I think, £3, or you could pay a bit more if you chose to, or you could literally just listen to my music on Spotify and watch my videos, that helps me get paid as well. Thank you very much for watching this video and for listening to me about all this stuff and supporting me. Uh, yeah, I appreciate it and I'll see you again soon.